Hello everybody, welcome to my channel Grammar Fun. My name is Jaya and we will be learning grammar together. Now we are going to look at chapter 13, Pronouns and the textbook exercises. So I want all of you to open your textbook. Open your textbook to page number 70, 70. Write today's date. Your first exercise, underline the pronouns and say what kind it is. So first you will underline and the side there is a blank and there you have to write what kind of pronoun it is. First one is already done. So second one, the cat was hiding itself under the bed. Now we know the pronoun is itself and it is in the object area, not in the subject part, in the object part. So that is reflexive pronoun. Third one. Each of the injured passengers was given first aid immediately. Each, each, neither, either. That is distributive pronouns. Fourth one. Everything looks beautiful when it rains. Everything. It is indefinite pronoun. Fifth one. The green dress is yours and the red dress is mine. So yours, mine. Both are possessive pronouns. Sixth one, he is a good cricketer and she is a talented singer. He and she, personal pronouns. Who is standing at the door? Who, interrogative pronoun. And last one, this is Shreya, whose father is a doctor. So, this, that is demonstrative pronoun and whose, relative pronoun. Let us look at exercise B. Fill in the blanks with the correct word from the bracket. So just take the correct word and write it in the bracket. First one is already done. Let's look at the second one. Please listen to Stella and me. Third one. Are you going to talk to them? They is used in the subject area. She is as intelligent as he. My views differ from yours. Possessive. Sixth one. They scored more runs than us. Seventh one. Their garden is larger than ours. Eighth one. The teacher appreciated Priya and her efforts to complete the work in time. So you have your third exercises you have to rewrite the sentence by omitting the relative pronoun so the relative pronoun has to be removed and you have to arrange the sentence correctly let us look at the second one the plane by which uncle Vasim came was delayed by more than two hours now here the relative pronoun is which you have to remove the which and you just have to arrange it means the preposition which is used before the relative pronoun here it is by that will be written after the verb. Which is the verb? The verb is came. So it will be written after that. So let us look how it is rearranged. The plane. Uncle Vasim came by. And the rest of the sentence was delayed by more than two hours. The third one. The girl to whom this dog belongs is my classmate. So we will remove whom and two will be put after the verb. So the answer is the girl this dog belongs to is my classmate. Fourth one, the pen with which I always write is missing. So we'll remove which and we'll arrange with. The answer, the pen I always write with is missing. Fifth one, have the police located the hotel in which the decoits were are hiding. So you will remove which and in will come after hiding. Have the police located the hotel the decoits are hiding in? Next question. The house in which Seema lives has a beautiful garden. Remove which? Arrange in. The answer is the house Seema lives in has a beautiful garden. Seventh one. The masons carried the bricks with which they wanted to build the wall. So, remove which, arrange with. 
the masons carried the bricks they wanted to build the wall with eighth question the gentleman to whom the briefcase belongs is rashi's uncle remove whom arrange to the gentleman the briefcase belongs to is rashi's uncle next is exercise d where you have to rewrite the sentences correctly second one the thieves were arrested by the police who had committed the bank robber now that relative pronoun has to be next to the noun which it is explaining okay now who had committed the bank robbery it was the thief so it should come after the thief so the thieves who had committed the bank robbery were arrested by the police that is how you should write it third one the students were called by the teacher who had not submitted the assignment now who had not submitted the assignment the student so it should be next to the students the students who had not submitted the assignment were called by the teacher fourth one the painting was displayed in the gallery which was beautiful which was beautiful gallery or painting painting was beautiful so the painting which was beautiful was displayed in the gallery fifth one shreya was congratulated by the principal who had won the trophy principal or shreya who won the trophy it was shreya so that clause or that sentence goes with shreya shreya who had won the trophy was congratulated by the principal sixth one the city had more remarkable monuments which had developed recently so the city which had developed recently had many remarkable monuments seventh one the book had a lot of valuable information which i had picked up from the library so the book which i had picked up from the library had a lot of valuable information eighth one the dog belongs to meena that has a curly tail so the dog that has a curly tail belongs to meena our last exercise is join each pair of sentences using a relative pronoun who whom which what okay look at the second one the students were declared the champions they belong to the red house now students so who the students who were declared the champions belong to the red house third one the house was at the end of the street it was burgled so this is house thing so the house that was burgled was at the end of the street fourth one rohan has a good handwriting he is the monitor of the class who you will use who because rohan is a person rohan who has a good handwriting is a monitor of the class we were waiting for our friends at the restaurant it is in our neighborhood so restaurant is in the neighborhood so it is about the restaurant so we were waiting for our friends at the restaurant that is in our neighborhood sixth one the flight was delayed it took off in the evening so it's about the flight so the flight that was delayed took off in the evening seventh one the suitcase was heavy nitin could not lift it so nitin could not lift the suitcase that was heavy see how it has changed we cannot write the suitcase was heavy that nitin could not lift it no that is wrong so we are just changing the sentence entirely by saying nitin could not lift the suitcase that was heavy eighth one the parrot is pecking at the goa it is ripe and juicy the parrot is pecking at the goa which is ripe and juicy now that is the end of the chapter i hope you all have understood thank you for watching and have a nice day